Yeah, I mean, have, have you talked to Colin at all no, since? I haven't, and, and, I, haven't, I haven't spoke to Colin Kaepernick. And no. if he's doing okay, does he? You wonder if the NFL, I hate to say blacklisting, but he's not in the league, and there's a lot of an awful lot of folks who think he should be playing football somewhere. I mean, yeah, what? you know, uh, but at the, at, you know, but then again, you know, football is only a part of your life. True. Um, you know, it's a, and it can be a good part of your life if you do the right things the right way. And I just think that, you know, it's wrong for people to try to blackball him or whatever, you know, because of what he believes in. You know, we all believe in something. I uh, hope. And, I, you know, I just don't think that, you know, what he did was wrong. You know, maybe, you know, it, it could have been another way for him to go about it, but um, – <laughs> he wanted to start a dialogue, you know, and we're having one here there tonight. There definitely is and one, I hope absolutely. People all over the country are having a conversation about the state of this country right. because it's not pleasant right now. But it's not. It's not a bad thing. I, I, no, it's not a bad thing. And there's so much more positive than negative, obviously, because we're all here today, today, and having a good time, living our lives. But there's just enough going on that is forcing, not forcing, but leading guys like Colin, leading guys like Martellus or Michael Bennett right. to at least take a stand and try and further the conversation. I want to talk. Thank yeah, Thanks. applause. Yeah, absolutely. And that's the number one thing, conversations. Stop with the hate. Stop with the anger. Stop yelling at one yeah. person. Stop threatening people's lives. Conversations, peaceful conversations will lead to I results. Saw a, yeah, I saw a tweet from Ellen DeGeneres, who I'm, I, you know, I like Ellen, She's, but she said, let's just be good humans today. Especially Absolutely. today. Every single good day. Line. It's easy to do, right. I think. A lot easier to do. Right. It takes a lot less energy. All right. Yeah. Back to football. Let's go back to I want to go back to the Super Bowl against the Ravens. You are now a part of the 47-minute lightning delay. Oh, yeah. But that right. Super Bowl, the finish controversial with a hold on Michael Crabtree, but also... Remembered for right. that 34-minute power outage. Yeah, yeah. What do you remember about that situation? What was that like to be a player when I the mean, lights go that out? That had to be wild. Yeah, I was like, man, wow, this is crazy. Because, <laughs> I mean, you know, it's, it's the Super Bowl. That's the main stage. And, then you know, it's a lot going on in the Super Bowl. You got Beyonce performing at halftime. That's right. You have all these celebrities in the stadium. You have all these people here to watch you play. And then something like this happens. But, you know, uh, it turned around to be good for us as a team because we were down by like 17 or 21 points at halftime. So, you know, when that happened and we came back, we, we actually came back and had a chance to win the game. So crazy. It was pretty cool for us. That was what? That was the Superdome, right? Yeah. yeah. New Orleans? Superdome. Yeah. 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 Lights. And the game finishes 34-31, but you guys had a shot on the goal line. Right. Was Michael Crabtree held? Uh, I don't know. What ah. do you think? Yes. Yeah, he was held. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> oh, he absolutely was held. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. And then you found out just how hard it is to get back. And there's a conversation in Green Bay every year with Aaron Rodgers here. Got to the Super Bowl seven years ago. Won it. It's hard to get back. It is. What is the biggest obstacle to getting back do you think I luck of the draw it can be injury a lot of, it can be a lot of different things i mean you know you can have a change of, you can have a big change of roster so a lot of guys can go it's always 30 percent minimum almost every okay, year about okay well that uh injuries uh you know you may you may you may lose a game that you should win throughout the season uh and not make it to the playoffs or not get the home field advantage that you were looking to get. It could be it could be a lot of different factors. Well, that's the ticket this year. Home field advantage for the Packers. I mean, I'm tired of going to Seattle for an NFC championship game that falls apart. I'm tired of going to Atlanta for an NFC championship that just wasn't very competitive. Stay home in January and let's see what happens. You've been around this team now a month. This team has Super Bowl medal. Nothing's guaranteed. Nothing's guaranteed in life. True. So, you know, I mean, not to, not to just keep chiming back in, like, but, you know, when I got released, a lot of people was just, like, telling me just go to New England. <laughs> I mean, if you go to New England, you're going to win a championship. 
And I, I'm thinking to myself, like, well, hey, you know, it's not guaranteed because last year, two years ago, Tom Brady didn't have any receivers. True. Nobody thought that they were going to make it to the playoffs because he didn't have anybody to throw the ball to. But by Tom Brady, by Tom Brady being so great, you know what I'm saying, he was able to get them all there. Get them all there. I, I will say he, that Patriots defense could use you right now. Yeah. <laughs> this yeah. year, yeah. They could use you big yeah. time.